Hey, superstars, it's your bestie Scott, and it is time for our May recap video. Um, it is also time for a haircut, but I doubt that you can help me with that. Anyway, fortunately for you, this is probably going to be a shorter video. I've got some VRs to do. I've got our uh, monthly shareholders meeting, and that's it. I behaved and I didn't buy anything, so I don't get to bore you with my silly Indians and Guardians cards too much. So let's do it. My bestie Dan, he is celebrating 400 subs and he's doing another giveaway. Dude loves his giveaways. Dan wants to see four cards with a grade of four and he wants four shout outs. So I really wanted to show off four of my Mars Attacks cards because I figured that would be right up Dan's alley, but I only have two fours. I got Robot Terror and Attacking an Army Base and I hope that's no one you knew, Dan. I'm sure all those guys are okay. So Mars Attacks won't work. So how about I do four cards that were gifted to me and then I can shout out the gifters. Brilliant, but I have five cards here. Um, I have a 1958 Topps Mini Minoso. This one's from Paul and Leah at Fast Breaks and Breakfast. Super awesome father and daughter duo. Love those guys. Definitely worth a watch. I've got this Dandy Bob Lemon. This one was gifted to me by Rick at Vintage Oddball Cards. I didn't really care for these Dandy cards until Rick sent me this one. Now I kind of love them. And uh, everybody knows Rick and he doesn't need any shout outs, but Rick's the best and he deserves one. Um... Here's another Bob Lemon, a 1951 Burke Ross, courtesy of Deke. And there's that old saying, when YouTubers give you lemons, make a VR. Uh, no, never mind. Uh, Doug's another one of my favorite people, not just on YouTube, but in this whole wide world. Super funny guy, but you all probably know that. Got to show at least one Mossy in my recap videos, right? This one was from my best buddy, Tony Black at TB's TTM Autographs. Tony is always looking out for me, always sending me stuff, and he's another really funny guy. Happy to give him a little shout out, but I've got one more and I don't want to break the rules, but this 1951 Larry Doby is awesome. Oh, but it's from Don's Field of Dreams. Um, I, I don't want to give him a shout out. So just forget I showed that last one. Hope that works for you, Dan. Congrats on 400. Crazy that you're almost to 500 already. My bestie John over at Wade Boggs Fan, he is celebrating 2,000 well-deserved subs, and he wants to know how this uh, YouTube community has enhanced our hobby. And uh, honestly, my answer isn't really much different than anybody else has done a VR for this one. Obviously, there's this unbelievable uh, community, you know, where we're all in this together and we're not collecting in a bubble like so many collectors do. Um, it's more fun doing this with such a great group of people and, and Don. And I guess personally, I learn a ton from you guys and I'm inspired a ton by you guys. And uh, most importantly, it goes well beyond the cardboard. I've got best friends all over the continent and um, I've got all this support. You know, when I decided to turn my hobby into a business, it's obviously been life-changing and a blessing. And um, when I'm not really in a position to buy cards like I am right now, I can share in the community's collections and live vicariously through you guys. And I really don't feel like I'm missing out when I'm not adding to my own personal collection. So I guess that's it. Uh, congrats, John. Super happy for you, sir. My bestie Theo is celebrating 1,000 subs and he wants us to card shame John from 3D 80s Kid. And I'm not really one to get in, in the middle of a spat like this. I like to keep it positive, you know, but I am a sucker for VR, so here goes. Here's my 49 Leaf Joe Gordon, which I'm pretty sure John did end up getting one of these. And I don't know if mine's nicer or not. Uh, John's got this uh, Bob Feller in a two, but I've got it in a four and a half and an autograph three. Boom, suck it, John. Sorry, um, I have this uh, 53 top Satch, and then I randomly have a 66 tops Catfish Hunter that I've had since I was a kid, and I have another one, and I would send this to you, John, but it's got a pretty gnarly crease in it. John's got plenty of cards that are nicer than the copies that I have, and uh, I feel like I'm being too nice, and Theo's probably going to disqualify me, but uh, there you go, Theo. Hope you enjoyed it. This is where I talk about all those super secret projects that I mentioned last month, but they're super secret and I can't tell you. Uh, actually, one of those projects I did with my bestie Greg at Midlife Sports Cards. He asked me to design a t-shirt for him because he hit 5,000 subs and he wanted me to put it up in my Etsy store. And uh, so he paid me my going rate and then I get to keep all the profits from those t-shirts, which is super cool of him. Uh, Greg's pretty awesome, but most of you already know that. 
This weekend, I am setting up at my first live card show. So I dug out the old vending machine out of the garage and I filled it with my custom cards and I am very excited about that. I'm also selling shirts and art and I filled up a 5,000 count box with quarter cards just so I can say that I'm selling cards. Not that the show promoter cared. I, I talked to him beforehand about all that. Um, anyway, if you're in the area, I'm, I'm doing the Medina County Collectors Convention at the Medina County Fairgrounds in Medina, Ohio. Imagine that on Friday, May 31st and Saturday, June 1st. For next month, I'm still plugging away at the other big super secret project and a bunch of commissions that I've got in the works. I've got more card shows that I'm looking into doing, and I'd still like to get back into the printmaking, but I might make that sort of a two month quasi focus. We'll see. Um, sometimes, you know, I've got too many ideas demanding my attention, uh, but I really like to finish stuff. So it's a tough balance. Before I go, my five year 1500 sub favorite uniform giveaway is over on Friday, May 31st. I've got way more entries than I ever expected, which is super cool. So uh, thanks to all of you who've entered so far. I am absolutely blown away and uh, we'll announce the um, results to that as soon as I can. That's it for now. Thanks to Dan, John, and Theo for the awesome VRs. Wish me luck this weekend at the card show. And as always, thank you guys for watching. Now go find a better video to watch and we'll see you real soon.